Hi my loves, so today I'm going to be showing you my Black Friday haul and everything that I got when I went shopping on Black Friday. I got mostly clothing, I didn't really get anything besides clothing and one pair of shoes. I guess I will just get started. First I'll start with Shopo. I got, I ordered their stuff online. I actually ordered it before Black Friday, but it came on Black Friday, and of course they had 30% off on Black Friday, but I couldn't wait, so I ordered it before. But I figured I'd include it, because you guys know I love Chopo. They're an awesome website, so I'll have a link to their website down below. But yeah, I'll show you everything that I got from there first, and then we'll move on to all the stuff that I got at the actual mall. So the first thing that I got from Chopo is this long, like, parka jacket. I have been wanting one of these very, very badly, so I finally got one. It has a nice fur collar, and it has all on the inside like sheep skin. It's very, very soft and fuzzy. I absolutely love it. It just looks so cute. Just throwing this on with like a pair of leggings or anything. It actually really does keep you warm because I kind of ordered this thinking that I'd have to wear like a real coat over top of it and I, this would kind of be more of a fashion coat, but this is like a real coat because like I said, it's filled with this like nice, soft, fuzzy stuff. So yeah, I really, really love this. And keep in mind if you do order off Shopo, it's an Australian website, so their sizes run much differently than the United States. So like for me, I got a medium in this, which is a size 10, where normally I'd probably get like a six in America in coats, but in Shopo, it's a size 10. They have like a size chart on their website, which will help you like see the different sizes, but their sizes run a lot different than ours do in the United States. So just be sure to look at that. Um, when you're ordering. The next thing that I picked up from them was a bodysuit. I have been obsessed with bodysuits recently, so I picked up this one. It crisscrosses in the front. It's just a black bodysuit. I just thought that I could wear this with so many different things. I think I'm definitely going to be wearing this probably on New Year's Eve. I'll show you guys. I got another thing actually when I was shopping at the mall that I think I'm going to wear with this for New Year's, but I thought it was just really, really cute, and in the winter you can layer like a cardigan over it. I just love bodysuits because I tend to tuck in my clothes a lot just to kind of emphasize my waist. Uh, a little bit more and bodysuits are just the easiest way to do that because you don't have to worry about your shirt like coming out or bunching up or whatever. This I got in a size 10 as well. The next thing that I got from them is this adorable off the shoulder shirt and then it has like these long little sleeves so it kind of emphasizes your shoulders. I thought this was really, really cute and has like a sweetheart neckline to it as well. It's adorable and it's cropped too. So it's definitely shorter and it has like really nice, cute detailing on the sleeves. It has like bell sleeves and like little crochet detailing on it. So I thought that this was absolutely adorable. I tried this on already with like a pair of jeans and it just looked so, so cute. Definitely really good for like going out or whatever. And this I got in a size 10 as well. Then I got this adorable off the shoulder shirt from there as well. It's very, very stretchy as you can see the top like stretches so much you can pull it off your shoulders and I just love the sunflower print to it this also kind of has cute little detailing on the sleeve and I just thought it was really cute I'm a sucker for sunflowers I've really been into sunflowers I wore them like all the time in the summer and I thought with the black background I could kind of pull this one into the winter so I thought that it was really really cute and again this one is cropped as well and the bottom is like super stretchy too it like stretches open a lot so I feel like this like would fit like all sizes pretty much but I got this one in a size medium. And then the last thing that I picked up from Chopo is this Celine sweatshirt. I have been wanting one of these very, very badly. It's a really nice white sweatshirt. When I saw it on the website, I thought it was kind of gonna be like, I don't know, like one of those like Hanes sweatshirts or something, but it's actually like a really nice sweatshirt. It doesn't have like fleece in the inside or anything, but it's a thicker sweatshirt. I really actually like it. It's like nicer than like what I thought it was gonna be. Um, but yeah, it's a really nice material and I just think this with leggings and like boots and like a sock bun or something just perfect for when you're just feeling lazy and you want to be warm and cozy and I thought that this would be great for days like that. So love that. Now we'll move on to everything that I got when I went to the actual mall. So the first place that I went to was Guess and I actually used to work for Guess way back in the day as like a sales associate. I don't work there anymore but I have loved it ever since I worked there. I just love their clothes. Clothes. They have the cutest things, but one thing that I always go to guess for is my jeans. This is not a sponsored video or anything like that. I honestly have just loved their jeans ever since I was in like literally middle school. I have like a strangely shaped body. I have a very large butt and um, like thigh and hip area, but my waist is pretty small at, in comparison. So I can like never find jeans that fit me right, like ever. I always have like a huge gap in the back of my jeans because of the waist and it's just like impossible to find jeans. The only place that I could ever get jeans that were like semi okay was Guess. So I always go to Guess for my jeans. Um, and they came out with a new kind of jean called the Curve X, I think is what it's called. And I read about it online, like on their website, and it seems like it was made for girls 
the exact type of body type that I have. So I was like, oh my God, need to try it. Went to the store, loved them. So I got two pairs. I got them in this kind of darker, like blue jean, like a classic jean, like wash. And I really, really like these. Yeah, they are called Curve X. So I got them in this darker blue wash. And then I also got them in this like coated black wash. It's kind of like shiny, almost looks like leather, but it's not, it's just like a coated black denim. Um, so I got both of them because I loved it so much. They come in a few other washes as well, um, but I only got these two. They did have like, it was anywhere from 30 to 50% off. So like the whole store was 30% off and then there was select things that were 50% off. Of course, these jeans were only 30% off, not 50. Um, but the jeans retail for 128. So I think with the 30% off, I ended up paying like about $90 or so for them. So, you know, still pricey, but for denim that really fits me well, like I'll spend whatever. I literally don't care because it's so impossible to find nice jeans for myself. So I was really happy that I found these and um, that's why I got them in both colors. I think I'm going to be getting a lot of use out of these. The next place that I went to was Express and I love Express. They always have the best Black Friday sales like literally ever. Um, so this year they have 50% off of the entire store. So yeah, amazing. And I picked up two things from Express. So the first thing that I got was this black leather. I forget what these are called. Um, oh my goodness, there's a name for them and now I can't think of them. Na it's not napkin. Is it napkin? Let me know in the comments. I think it's napkin skirt, I think. I don't know. It's like the skirt that comes to the point on your legs. These are black leather. I just thought they were so, so cute. They were 50% off, so they originally retailed for $59.90, and so I got them for like 30 bucks. And I just thought they were so cute. They looked really cute on. I think these with like a pattern tight would be really, really cute. These are what I wanted to wear with the black bodysuit that I showed you guys from Chopo, maybe with some tights and some boots or something for New Year's Eve. I'm not sure yet, um, but I really liked these. They fit really, really nicely. Then I forgot I actually got this and saw it in the bottom of my bag, but I actually picked up a lip gloss when I was at Express because I was like waiting online and they had like this big thing with all these lip glosses in it from their um, like stuff. And I was like, oh my God, like I've never tried a lip gloss from Express or anything. And they retail for $7, but since everything was 50% off, they were only $3.50. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to try one and see because, you know, I'm a sucker and I love makeup and $3.50 for a lip gloss isn't even that much. So I picked up this little like baby pink one. I don't know, I thought it was cute. We'll see, it probably will be like horrible quality. Express makes clothes, not makeup, but I figured I would just try it out. It's called Strawbana Twist. So I don't know, I thought it was a pretty color. So I was like, it can't be that horrible. Let me just try it. So I picked that up. And then the last thing that I picked up from Express, I am literally obsessed with. I've had my eye on this for quite some time and it is this white, leather moto jacket. I absolutely love it. I just thought that this was the cutest thing. It fit me really, really nicely. I just loved like all the detailing on it and everything. It's called their minus the leather um, jacket, I think. Uh, I'm not sure. It's still on their website though because I was like stocking it for like a week before Black Friday. I knew I really, really wanted this because it retails for $128, which is pretty pricey, um, but I got it for 50% off. So I only paid like like 65. <laughs> I'm like trying to do the math in my head. I'm like, oh my God. So I made like $65 for it, which still is like kind of pricey for a jacket, but this one fit me really, really nice. It is lined on the inside as well. So it will keep you like decently warm. And I don't have a white leather jacket. I have 5 billion black ones and gray ones and tan ones. and I don't have a white one. So I really, really wanted a white one and I really, really liked this one. So I did go ahead and pick it up for myself. And then the last place that I went was Lord and Taylor's. And I love Lord and Taylor's. I know that I don't think it's like a national thing. I feel like Lauren Taylor's is a Northeast thing. I don't know that for sure. Maybe just like the East Coast. I think they might have them in Florida. I don't know, but I love Lauren Taylor's. They're amazing. I go there all the time. They have the best shoe section. Like I love Lauren Taylor's shoe section. It's amazing. So they had on their shoes, I believe it was 20% off or something. There were certain shoes that were more off. The ones that I got were 20% off and I fell in love with them and needed them. So I bought them immediately. So the shoes that I got were from BCBG Generation. I love BCBG. Like I love anything from them and they are just the cutest shoes. I'm obsessed with them. They are these black booties. I just thought that they were so cute, so perfect. I needed a black booty and then they do have a little gold zipper detailing on this side. They are really, really comfy, which is what I wanted because I wanted a booty with a heel, but I didn't want it to be too high of a heel because um, I still wanted them to be wearable, maybe able to like run around in them and everything like that. And I totally can because I kind of wanted them for every day, 
but I didn't want them to be flat. I don't know. I wanted something a little bit dressier. Um, so I got these, but they're still totally like manageable for every day. They're very, very comfy. So I absolutely love these. I believe that they retailed for 130 or something, but then I got like $20 off. So they were 110 and then an additional 20% off of that. So I think they were around like $90, 85 or so. Um, but they're just amazing. I love them. I know I'm going to get so much use out of them. So that's why I did decide to pick them up for myself. So yeah. yeah, that is everything that I got when I went Black Friday shopping. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please be sure to like it and subscribe and let me know in the comments any of these items that you want to see in a lookbook. And also let me know what you guys got on Black Friday because I'd love to know what you guys got. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.